Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel and thank you so much for tuning in again. Here's a quick video of me doing my own nails. The prep process starts off with me using a cuticle bit to remove any dead skin. Going in with this fine sanding band to etch the nail plate very lightly. Using Katie as tip glue to glue on the tips. I like a curve. I'm going to etch the tips to blend them in and use a little bit of acetone to erase the seam and here is Seabon primer of course for retention I'm going to be polishing on uh, foil gel and then carrying that and applying on these funky looking foils and then I'm going to apply a gel top coat over those foils and cure that as well this is a nude cover powder to complete an ombre design I didn't like the foils, but I wanted to still do something cute, so you can never go wrong with ombre. And I'm trying very hard not to disturb that design with my brush and my monomer. And once I'm done with the ombre, with this really pretty cover powder, I'm going to apply a layer of see-through super clear acrylic on top of the entire nail to encapsulate the design and also encapsulate that ombre blend so I don't mess it up when I'm filing and shaping with the e-file and my hand file. The encapsulation has to be thick enough to accommodate these long nails. And then I'm going to start the shaping process using this extra coarse sanding band. This process is like not necessary but it speeds up my time but you can just go in with the hand file if you don't want to use the e-file but I also still go in with the hand file it's an 80 grit and I use that to just make my shape a lot more crisp then this is a medium sanding band to do one final blend of the nail to make it nice and smooth and then sealing the cuticle area using the comb bit now I'm all finished but it's not time to moisturize yet because I still have to do a gel top coat and once I cure that I'm going to go in and do these um, 3d acrylic designs I wasn't in the camera view for a lot of the designing so I'm sorry y'all but um, here's what I could get on camera but here's the finished result and yeah I like them because they curve and they're long you know me but thanks again for tuning in god bless